They are beautiful. Very graceful, aren't they? Aren't they? Gorgeous. The they soar through the sky. Fabulous at their back. Right, okay, weather. And it was much better today. Cold, but bright and sunny. Oh, yes, I do love the sunshine. But the forecast wouldn't be a forecast without a little bit of uncertainty. Of it wouldn't. And that's coming on <laughs> Thursday. Natasha Weyers took this lovely shot of the morning mist near Romsey. Look at this one. That spring that's arrived in Blandford, Helen Gallimore. Thank you. And Penny Wade took this picture of deer in the sunshine in Petworth Park. Through the course of today, we've had a good deal of sunshine. There were one or two sharp showers here and there. They will gradually ease overnight tonight. But this glorious picture captured by one of our weather watchers in Wimborne was taken earlier on today in the sunshine. Now, tonight there will be clear skies and tomorrow we're expecting some rain. The rain will start to nudge its way in. It will be quite a cool day with outbreaks of rain on and off throughout the day. So with clearing skies tonight, temperatures will fall away below freezing in some spots. A little bit more cloud will arrive to the southwest. That's the weather front starting to edge its way in first thing tomorrow morning. Temperatures could fall as low as minus one, maybe minus two degrees. So it will be cold, potentially frosty start to the day tomorrow with some mist and fog patches. It's a bright start, but very quickly the cloud will increase and the rain will move north and eastwards. It could be heavy for a time, trying out for western areas later on. And we may even see a little bit of brightness down towards Dorset and Wiltshire with temperatures rising to between seven and 10 Celsius. So on the inshore waters tomorrow, the winds are southeasterly five to seven, veering southwesterly four or five, then veering northwesterly five or six. The visibility is moderate or good, occasionally poor. Now the rain will continue tomorrow night for a time and gradually start to ease during the early hours of Thursday morning. When it does ease, we'll still have a good deal of clouds, so it will be slightly milder tomorrow night with lows of between three and seven Celsius. So quite a cloudy start to Thursday. A little bit of uncertainty about a low pressure system skirting the south coast in the Isle of Wight. We may have some rain and this is the area of low pressure we're talking about. Areas uh, along the south coast in the Isle of Wight may see some rain first thing on Thursday. Still a lot of uncertainty as to how far north that rain band will be. We're looking at it clearing south and eastwards. Once it does, we'll have a good deal of cloud, maybe with some sunny spells through the course of the afternoon. So it was a fairly unsettled rest of the week. We are looking at some rain tomorrow, which could be heavy in places, lasting through much of the day, continuing for some tomorrow night. Then on Thursday, maybe a band of rain for the south coast and the Isle of Wight. Still uncertainty about that. But on Friday, should be a mainly dry day with some sunny spells and the odd shower. Sally. Thanks, Alexis. Um, if you want to know how talented people are in the South, watch tomorrow because it's the first auditions for the TV talent show, The Voice in South Sea. We are going to be there. Obviously not singing because we're not that talented. <laughs> That's it from us. Good night. Good night. <laughs>